Hello chat, Dan VR. So I'm taking y'all down a trip on memory lane to this forbidden mechanic. The worst mechanic ever implemented to Deep Woken. And that is luck. Now if you thought progression now was bad, good god, you should have played the game when it first came out. So, first of all, obviously with the old progression, it's 0 to 60. And you required luck. Luck was gained from either killing corrupted mobs or typically from killing a player a higher level than you. This gaining luck would affect the rarity of cards that you pulled in your talent hands. Now at first, you had no way of knowing how much luck you had. The only way you even knew you had luck is if you killed a player and it like shined some particles on you. That was the only indicator you had. And this got real fucking wild when we got the uh, infamous Agamatsu video, Why You Should Kill More People, which uh, turned the game into a fucking war zone at all times. We've never recovered from that hit. But what ends up happening is you have the most inconsistent, unfun progression on Earth. You could farm luck like corrupted mobs for what feels like an hour right to like oh like i have max luck for sure i have to have a hundred percent and then pull no rares and no legendaries get absolutely nothing it was so wildly inconsistent and no one even knew what was really happening because you couldn't see your luck state you just had to guess oh i bet i have a hundred percent luck you couldn't even get a hundred percent luck nobody knew that of course and then things got a little better with the trial of one update now you could get Adept, the card that made progression factor faster, and Mark of the Lone Warrior made progression a little bit faster. But what you did, pretty much all the way up until the release of Layer 2, is just farm Trial of One for actual hours, until by the grace of God, you finally get a run that has decent cards, like two Legendaries, three Legendaries, and a couple Rares. And then from there, you prog the rest of the build, which isn't even guaranteed to be good. I've gotten really good trial of one runs, and then I get to like power 40 or 50. I'm like, holy shit, I've gotten no cards that I want. No rerolls, nothing. There was nothing. If you had a bad build, you just wipe. It was the most miserable experience. I swear to God, Deep Woken is kept alive by the sunken cost fallacy. We're all here like, holy shit, I've already played for a year and a half. I might as well keep playing. You know, if I quit now, it was all a waste of time. Ugh. Okay. Like and sub. 20k in uh, 13 days. 